Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 5 of Let's Play Mega Man Star Force Deluxe. Alright, just on the uh, EM road of Space Sim before we go back to the dungeon. Because it turns out I took a path and there was actually this right here. But that was only Heat Ball 2. So now we gotta head back into the actual level. We shall do that now. Alright, I've been cycling through some of my cards. I want to try some different ones. I think we'll give this one a chance. See how well it works for me. You know, if I didn't miss, like a moron. Oh yeah, I'll let go at the worst possible time imaginable. It's been like several days. In fact, probably well over a week since I've recorded the previous episode, so I might be a bit sloppy. Actually, there's no might. I am sloppy. At least my HP is above 200 max. So that'll save me from myself. There we go. Good to know I didn't completely forget where to get to. Now we're in here. A giant planet is blocking the road. Okay, I guess I just leave. Hey, Geo! Look up there! Up where? Oh, the other screen, Geo. Look at the other screen. There's something there. Quack. Who goes there? It spoke. Quack. We are the Quacky Lackeys. We are loyal servants of Lord Cygnus. I've heard of you guys. Something about a bunch of noisy ducks. Ducks? Did you just say ducks? What? Insolent fool. We are beautiful purebred swans. But you're not even remotely white. Well, that's kind of racist. What do you know? Mind your own business. Take this! Dance of the stars! Move, Geo! That was close. What? How was that? Not bad, duckies. You said it again! What? Unforgivable! A duck's wrath is to be feared! You'll see, I thought you weren't ducks. Uh... You just called yourself a duck there. Just a bunch of quackers in denial, huh? Ah! What the hey? What? We will shower you in star shards. Everyone, man your positions. Hey, Geo! Look at that. Use those rockets to blast certain little birdies out of the sky. If we take them all out, this area should go back to normal. Wow, apparently it's duck season in here. Just watch out for the yellow squares. 800 zennies, awesome. And a fight immediately afterwards, not awesome. mess up on this one. Okay, that went really well. Enough to get S rank still. There's a rocket. Quack. Think you can hit me? Go ahead and try then. Touch and slide the rocket up. Or hold the A button and press up to fry some duck. How fast does it move? Fast enough. I got it in one go. I've been barbecued! Lord Cygnus! <laughs> you got what you deserved. 
Wow, they only let one duck do the whole thing. Sure, there'll be later instances where you have to face, like, maybe... Oh, come on! That wasn't fair! Two ducks at a time. What the... <laughs> oh, the... those stars. Can't wait to get rid of those. Okay, we'll try this way. What's this? HP Mem 20? Well, yeah. You don't get enough time to move. Like, it's already committed to hit ya. That's hella rude. Okay, I think I saw some green, uh, programs over there, or mystery waves. I gotta remember to call them Mystery Waves. I almost called them Mystery Data. Right. Think it hit me? Go ahead and try then. I missed. What happens if you miss? <laughs> what were you aiming at? Are you guys okay? Whack. Arg! Alright, one more time. And it just brings in another rocket. There we go, I waited a bit longer. I've been barbecued! Lord Cygnus! Huh, you got what you deserve. Yeah, they say the same thing. Alright! Looks like we can move forward now. That arrow looks like it'll send me back to the start of this section. Aha, more mystery waves. Jet attack one. What's over here? Nothing. Maybe there'll be something there later. Alright, let's see what's beyond this way. More of the same, of course. What we got here? 480 zennies! That's kind of random, but I'll take it. Oh! Oh, I almost made it to safety. One of these days I'll understand the pattern of this a lot better, but it's not this day. Oh, come on! Not really giving me much of a chance there, game. Got Ice Stage. Did you see that pattern? Like, the entire top half was just gonna be bombarded. I can't get into that rocket fast enough. There, first try. We. Doesn't make him there be less stars. They'll still be coming. I gotta find the next rocket. Oh god, that was going real fast. What the hell? Oh ho ho! I can't believe I hit, got the hitbox right there. That was lucky. I know it's a dangerous zone, but there might be some green waves here. Indeed, there are. Oh! <laughs> this is. That's just so dumb. I mean, there are probably going to be worse gimmicks out there to deal with other than just falling stars that you can't telegraph fast enough. But it is what it is. Thousand zennies! Hells yeah. I would gladly take whatever monetary value I can get. Find a rocket fast enough. There it is. Okay, 
What is your pattern? That. Dead. That's your pattern. The hell could be dead if he could be talking? He's dead inside, okay? It's dead inside. That's all that matters. Now we gotta head over to that spot where we can get to. There we go. Ah, this way. Oh, come on! Oh, it's right there, too. Oh, that's a big crow car. That's a cool name. Go away. I got 10 10. That's funny. Okay, there's another planetoid that I gotta deal with. I don't know which way I should go to first. We'll try this one. Wow, okay. Uh, screw me, I guess. <laughs> Damn. Holy shit! Gatling 1! Okay, where's the rocket? There's a rocket. Oh, this one's going fast! Nice. I played a few best space invaders in my time. I know what it means to lead a shot. Let's try this way again, because I think there was another path. Okay, at least this pattern actually is a pattern. Okay, don't go that way. That way leads to nothing. And I still walked into it like a dumbass. Amazing. You better be thankful I'm editing out a lot of battles, because it gets real tedious to watch them all. Hell, it's tedious to do them all, and I... Right again. Oh my god, that time I I shot it too early. There. Get sucked, you stupid duck. Yeah, the duck is stupid, even though I missed it several times. Not me. Okay. Yeah, I guess they do have more patterns than I thought they do. It just feels like they don't. Like, it just gets so random. I don't know, maybe it's just me whining like a little bitch again. See how much easier it is when you take your time, Bonga? Yes, I know it's easier if I actually took my time. But I don't like taking my time. I have years of playthroughs that show you that. My time is precious, okay? And I know yours is precious too. Stupid of me. What I think I could. Oh, raise that. Oh, okay. I just don't even try to heal. What the frick is this? Just go, just go. That's scary looking. Radar Missile 1, I already got that. It's a waste.
Okay, this pattern looks a little easy. Okay, that was a little too close. As soon as I say it's easy, I mess up. Amazing. That was the same spot! Come on! There. Did it a little bit earlier. And look at that, it actually worked. Okay, that's where I gotta go to get to the boss. Let's throw down Cygnus. I've got you now! Hmm? A human? Here? Who are you? Hey, Cygnus! Impossible! Omega Axis? <laughs> I'm surprised to run into you here. And what is it with that form? It looks like you fused with a tiny child. What about you? Aren't you using a weakling of a man? Before you fused with him, he could never have brought himself to do something like this. Yeah, he, he's not one to go for attempted homicide. What did you do to him? <laughs> I didn't do anything to him. This is what he wanted. Isn't that so? I was betrayed. The flat pack is my invention. Aaron, he... <laughs> the person on that monitor. Is that Mega Man? That incident wasn't a dream? I was betrayed. The flat pack is my invention. Aaron, he... He claimed it was his own. But that's not true. I never claimed that, I swear. Hmm? You can hear us, Aaron? Huh. Those were some ugly lies you just spewed. But it's the truth. I absolutely positively never claimed that. I would never steal anyone's invention. Aaron, I want to thank you. Because you are the one who made me realize that betrayal is the essence of society. It's hopeless. This guy won't listen. So now what? We use brute force. What else? We have to. It's all up to us. Omega Axis. The Andromeda key is with you, yes? In that case, I'll be taking it back. <laughs> Here I come. I won't be betrayed again. If you want betrayal, if you want to feel the pain of betrayal, then I will be the one to deal it in spades. Here he comes! Rock his world! Alright, boss time. Cygnus wing. Alright, I don't have no idea what its movement pattern is gonna be, so let's get a barrier up. Okay, it throws a bunch of feathers. Okay, I can do that too. Oh, so if you destroy the the white duck, you'll get rid of it instantly. That's good to know. I that's a good idea to move in case it's the, uh, dance. There we go. Now I can start piling on the pressure. You know, until it somehow moves. How dare you use evasive maneuvers? Oh 
Hopefully this hits. Well, I knocked it at Silly for a moment. Not that it mattered. Didn't do as much as I'd hoped. I got mostly recovery. Let's just use... Just have one of them on the... On the down low. And that's why. I think if you hit the black ones, they just keep going. I wouldn't be surprised. Okay, that move just paralyzes it or confuse it longer. Okay, one more well placed hit and it's out. Nice! It went right into that attack. Well done, Mega. Ooh. Can you hear me? Tom! Please stop. Please listen to me. Tom, I think there's a misunderstanding. Aaron. I see you stopped dancing. I would never steal anyone's invention. Please don't lie. I heard you. You were bragging to the kids about the flat pack. No! You've got it all wrong! The flat pack is my assistant's invention. That's what Mr. Boreal said. He said it's really good and he praised it. Lies. I see. You are banding together in an effort to defeat me. What? What do I have to do to make you believe me? Something you can do to make me believe you? I know. How about this? Aaron, I want you to show me some proof. Show me how one person trusts another. What do you want me to do? I want you to remove your helmet. Right here. Right now. What? His helmet? But there is no oxygen in here. What if I were to say, I filled this space with oxygen earlier? Would you believe my words? You fill this, this space with oxygen? But that's impossible. How? What if I said I did it last night? No. See? Just as I thought. You can't trust me, can you? You have no reason to trust me either. I may be lying, and maybe so are you. You see? That is how it is. We can't even trust our so-called friends. To say nothing of other people. You want me to take off my helmet? Yes. One simple task. But you can't, can you? You won't. I trust you, Tom. Mr. Boreal? You're not serious. There's no way he's going to. Ah! Phew. There really is oxygen in here. But it's a bit thin... And not the best, either. No way! There really is oxygen? I impossible! But... What if I was lying? What then? I'd have dealt with it then, if I had to. But like I already told you, I trust you. You trust me? You risk your life based on that? The Tom I know would never, ever put anyone in danger. But, I'll say it as many times as I need to. I trust you. So please trust in me. Um, was I a bit too forceful there? <laughs> Ugh. Don't listen to him. He's trying to trick you again. Tom, I want to ask you one thing. 
Do you know why brother bands exist? What kind of question is that? They're useful. Isn't that the only reason? You're wrong. The reason we need brother bands is because... Relationships are the essence of society. I know what happened to you in your past. So I understand why you lost your faith in society. But please, don't think that the only thing in this world is betrayal. Don't listen to him. Betrayal is all there is. Look around you. Look hard. If you do, I'm sure you will see. You'll see things other than betrayal. You'll see the good things in this world. And I believe you'll begin to realize that this world isn't such a bad place after all. So please listen and believe in what I'm saying. Tom! Uh, uh. What the? Ah! Huh? He changed back? He chased Cygnus out of his heart. Tom, are you okay? Tom! Mr. Dubious! Let's get moving before things get messy. This guy's fine. He'll wake up soon enough. Yeah. Mr. Dubious woke up a few hours later. His memory of what happened was spotty, and he was a little confused. But he clearly remembered what Mr. Boreal said. Relationships are the essence of society. And then... I'm very sorry about what happened today. I didn't mean to put you guys in danger. I know you didn't. That was great! Well, come back and visit anytime. Yes, of course. Goodbye! I thought she was going to chastise me to come to school again. I should get going too. Oh, tell your mom I said hi. And another thing. Yes? Relationships are the essence of society. I heard that from my mentor when I worked at NASA. It was your dad. My dad? He said that? How about it? Thinking of let those words into your heart? Dad, I... Hey! Come on! Ack, wait up! A few days later... I've done it! It's finished! Wait, the flat pack is finally done? That's awesome! It's just like you said, Aaron. Make the wings bigger, and they will stay balanced much better in the air. Let's go out and celebrate tonight. Sure. But if you eat too much, you'll get even bigger. Why, you... I can't believe you said that! You know why I said that? Because... I'm your brother. Ha ha ha! You got me there! Okay, let's go. <coughs> and for your information, I'm gonna eat and party to my heart's content. Man, I wish I had a flat pack. Geo! Geo! Ugh! Before you, a great calamity lies. There are two paths from which to choose. Should you not obtain the power to defeat it, the vortex of chaos will swallow all. However, if you open your heart, 
you will find the power to defeat the darkness that will inevitably arrive. It is in your hands which future will be, and which will not. We are always watching you. Which future I... choose? And you guys... Ugh! A dream? What a strange dream! Mega? You're awfully quiet! Meh, whatever. Ding dong. Someone's here! But Mom will get the door. Wait! Mom's got a part-time job today! Guess I have to go answer it. Mega? Don't you think it's about time to get up? Hmm? He's not here. I wonder where he went. Mega! Where are you? Oh yeah. I should put on my visualizer. Where did he wander off to? Please don't let him find more FMEans. Yeah, you know, somebody's still at the door. Oh, right! The person at the door! Ark! I wonder where that Mega went off to. Looks like I got some mail. Big wave? Hey! All you fine surfers of Echo Ridge! My card shop, Big Wave, is now open! I've got all the most gnarly cards! You won't find any wash-ups, I mean it! So if you're into riding the waves, then ride on into my card shop! Cowabunga! Oh my god, that's so tacky. Well, at least the card shop is now open. Yes? Who is it? Do I know you? Hmm. Abnormally high levels of Z-waves. I'll need to do a more thorough search here. What on earth is going on in this town? I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. Thief! A, a thief! Aw, oh, I did it again. Sorry to surprise you, little boy. When I really get into my work, I kind of forget about my surroundings. I'm not a thief, so calm down, yeah? That sounds like something a thief would say. Well, if you're not a thief, then what are you doing randomly bursting into people's houses like that? The name's Bob Copper. I got a lead, so I'm here to do some investigating here in your town. Wait, he's a policeman or someone working for the police force and his last name is Copper? Wow. Investigating? Then you're a police guy? Yuppers. Now how about calming down, yeah? If you're really a cop, then what are you investigating? That incident with the truck recently, and the thing that happened at a Macon a few days ago in the space sim. But I thought they were all taken care of. Yes, that's true. They were. But there's something they have in common. Both sites were covered in Z-waves. We detected some of that special kind of wave, and I don't know what kind of thing is giving them off. But it's my job to find the source. He's talking about waves the Ephemians make. So, what if you find the source? Then... It's probably a bad thing for humans. Waves and radiation, after all. So, obviously, I'll destroy it when I find it. Bang! Yeah? Destroy? Anyway, this area... No, actually... 
This house is giving up very strong Z waves. You notice anything strange, boy? Strange? Telling this guy about Mega and the FMians is probably not such a good idea. The other places I checked out, you. You were at a make it when it happened, right, Geo? How do you know my name? I put any and all info related to Z-Waves into my transfer as reference. So during the Amakin incident, you were exposed to a large quantity of Z-Waves. I would guess that's why you got Z-Waves coming out of the, your, the ears from you now. Really? You have a feeling okay? Nothing odd with your body? Nope. Sounds like I'm about to tell you I confused with an alien and turn into EM waves. You telling me the truth? And have you seen any monsters around? Nope. Although an alien does live in my trancer. You really telling me the truth here? Yes, sir. I see. Well, I'll be on my way then. Thanks for your help and cooperation. You're welcome. Man, I wish I had eyebrows that thick. Great! Someone else to complicate my life. I've gotta hurry up and find Mega. Well, I guess I should check out the card shop next. Oh, you need help? A card shop, big wave, seems to have it all. The shop owner, Mr. Souther, is a bit gaudy. But he's a nice laid-back person. Oh, you need help too? That thing over there is a card trader. Put in a few battle cards you don't want anymore and you'll get a new one in return. Hurry, right, I'm Trader Man 3, at your service. Give me three battle cards to trade for one of mine. So how about it? Wanna trade? All right, I don't need that many ground waves. Ice Meteor 1. All right, let me try again. Plasma Gun 1. Oh, really? I'm not getting much of value. Hey, you! I want you to fight me. What? What's your problem? Don't look down on me because you think I'm a kid. I can tell you what you're hiding. You've got an FMian living with you, right? How did you know that? <laughs> you and me, we're the same. I got this FMian named Cancer who's been living in my transfer since a while back. That means that I can wave change too. So how about a battle? Let's see. Where should we hold it? Oh, I know. How about the Omegan Foyer Wave Road? I'll be waiting for you. Weirdo. Serves up! Got some good stuff, so take a look. Oh, you got some HP memes, eh? Oh, but a recover 80 would be better. Okay, Poison Pharaoh is a Giga card, but it's so expensive. Blazing Edge is just a fire sword. Anti-sword is a trap to use against swords. Stun knuckle? Punch and paralyze enemy in the front. I think I'll get the reco- not the recover 80, the HP mem. Oh my god, I can get another one, but I don't have enough money. Okay, I guess that's good for now. I guess while I'm here, let's take out my uh, weak recover cards. Take out two 30s, so I can put in the 80s. Gotta find Mega! You couldn't have gone very far. I got all these quests to do, too. Can I go in any of these houses? I guess we can take a look-see. 
Fancy condo complex. Okay, I can't go in the house. I can go to Bud's house. Mega's not here, so I can't transform. Better steer clear of viruses for now. Oh, that's a shame. It's a computer, but all it does is collect dust. I wonder what's inside the fridge. Sports equipment, along with some really nasty smells. I don't think anyone's been ma made this bed in ages. Pajamas. Wow. That guy is a total hog. So I can't even go onto the waves either. Still can't go to school. It's like he's allergic to it. Mega, where are you? Mega! What's with this music? Is someone else here? What's up with that machine? Do you need to use this space? I'll be done in a sec. Please wait. How is the music still going when you stop playing? Whew! Finished! So what do you think? Um... Nice song. You think so? That's a relief. It's a new song I just made up. I wonder if my mama will be proud. You were playing that song for your mom? Yeah. I composed songs for my mama. My mom is always very happy whenever I play a new song of mine for her. Did you hear it, Mama? I composed a great song. Sorry to have made you wait. I'm gonna get going now. Bye! <laughs> Do I sense puppy love? Oh, it's you. Ah! Mega! Where did you come from? And where were you? The music caught my attention, so I took a look. I felt the loneliness waves that attract FMEans coming from the music she was playing. Loneliness waves? It's a peculiar frequency that people with loneliness in their hearts carry, kid. And what about the FMEans? Cool it. There aren't any around. Oh. Hey, Mega. Do you know about Z-Waves? You mean the waves us FMians transmit? I knew it! Earlier, there was a strange guy named Copper and he came to the house. He said he was looking for the Z-Wave source. And he said when he found it, he'd destroy it. Wow. I'm touched. You came looking for me because you were all worried, huh? It was nothing like that. Ah, uh, just admit it already, kid. Oh, hey. Do you know that girl that was here? No? First time I ever saw her. That's good. Why? Nothing. Come on, let's go home. Okay. It's a pitching machine with a wicked fastball. Doesn't seem like I can do anything with it at the moment. Arr! What the hey? The Z-Waves are acting up all of a sudden. If this keeps up, I won't get a good readout. Oh, it's Copper again? Oh no, it's those three. Er. Well, if it isn't Geo. Hey, you look like you're in a bad mood. Anything happen? Be quiet, you. 
Mind your own business. Yeah, mind your own beeswax. We got scoped up by some creepy old guy named Copper just now. He even checked our transers. But, you just told him everything. Eric! Men should keep their mouths shut. That's sexist. Having to show that old man what was in my transfer. I've never been so humiliated. Come on, bud. Zack. Let's go. She's really not in the best of moods. Yeah. Something tells me she's not gonna let us go home anytime soon. I feel bad for the Prez. But Sonya Strum's live concert is tomorrow. Yeah. I wanna get home early and rest up. We finally got those tickets and all. I really wanna see her in person. Um, who's Sonya? You don't know who she is? Sonya Strum is the hottest musician on the charts. Bud and I are both members of her fan club. Sonya's gonna have a concert tomorrow. Right here on Echo Ridge. We're gonna cheer with all we got. And tonight, we're gonna have star-shaped cakes for dessert to commemorate her heavenly singing. Oh, cool. But you saw the press today. Whenever she's in a bad mood like that, meetings last forever. Should we try to make a break for it? But what'll happen to us if we do? Look, bud. We can see the Prez every day. But do you think we'll get to see Sonya again? I'm sure even the Prez will let us go this time. What are you two doing? Hurry up! Prez! We're sorry. She got ditched. <laughs> I was too sure of it rough. Heck! Should this guy even be allowed near a school? This is bad. If he sees you in my transfer... Ah! He's coming! That's funny. I thought I... I thought some strong Z-ways were coming from this area. But... Hmm... Just my imagination. Looks like the coast is clear. Was that the old copper guy you mentioned? Yeah. You got some guts, kid. Keeping our secret. Wonder if we could dig up some info on that guy. How are we going to do that? By busting into his transfer. What else? Come on, kid. Man. Going into a person's transfer again? Fine. You want to go ask the guy face to face? Uh, no. That's... And going into his transfer is the only way. I... I guess... Oh god, it's playing stressful music now. I wonder where he is. Which way did he go off to? Oh, he's over there. Oh, I guess I know what to do next. Is there much I can do in the meantime? Can I do those side quests? Maybe I could go back to a Megan as well, but I could probably wait. Oh, it's Chase again! I wonder if the kid with glasses I gave the RC to is getting any good at it. And if my propeller man is helping. That's the guy who gave me the RC helicopter! I haven't been using it at all. 
Do you think we should go over there and show them that it's still working? Uh, yeah? Let's do that. Why don't we actually just do that right now before we end the episode? Yeah? Oh, it's you! The boy I gave the RC chopper. How's it working? Have you gotten any good at flying it? I know. Why don't you show me what you can do? What do you say? Yeah, you look confident. Let's see what you got. Okay now, show me how much you've learned. There are three balls hidden in very high places somewhere in this town. Use the RC chopper, find them, and knock them down from their hiding places. Propeller card, card in! Here we go, Propeller Man. Let's find the three balls and knock them down. Oh, there's one. Should look on the rooftops everywhere. Those are usually the best places to look. Second one. the third one at? Is that it? Wow! You're really good! You're even better than me! This is thanks for showing me your skills. Ah, an RC magazine! Now I feel like I have to keep on practicing. Okay, so that task is now done. Alright, I think the best thing for me to do now is save and stop the video here. And in the next part, we'll uh, get into that guy's transfer. See everyone, thanks for watching.